upcoming event is the annual spring concert that's held at Pomona every year. We're generally the last event on the season of the Department of Theater and Dance. And uh, we happen to be on alumni weekend, which is great because a lot of alumni come back and get a chance to see what's going on uh, at Pomona and, and uh, visit the theater department and visit the dance program and see our students in action, which is great. We are going to see uh, a mix of student works, senior thesis pieces, and we're going to see uh, some works by guest artists. We were very fortunate this year because we had the benefit of the Mellon Elemental Arts funding uh, to support some of the work that is going to be culminating with this concert. Um, the focus of the elemental arts this year has been on water and bringing to light issues that have to do with water in Southern California. So we were able to bring in a guest artist from New York, a wonderful choreographer by the name of Peter Pucci, who used to be with Palabolas Dance Theater, and he created a crazy piece called Surfing, which is uh, dancers on surfboards. Then we have another piece which is also water related and this is a modern ballet piece choreographed by Linda Lehovic from the University of Illinois at Champaign-Urbana and this particular piece I think really shows off our strong uh, ballet dancers uh, in a very very modern genre. The senior pieces that are coming up, of course, are extremely varied. They always are, which makes it really interesting. Um, this year's seniors are Tulsi Mehta and Justine Gordon and Elizabeth Ikejimba. And uh, they, they have very diverse backgrounds, very diverse interests, and, and I think that um, each of their works will contribute something really interesting to the concert. Tulsi's piece uh, is uh, draws from her background in Indian classical dance. Um, Chinello, or Elizabeth's piece, is um, a solo, um, a very kind of introspective piece about uh, what happens uh, in, in the socialization process when one goes to college. And Justine's piece is really uh, rooted in the history of hip-hop culture. So, uh, you know, stylistically they're all different and their approaches are all different, so I think it'll be really interesting to see how, how they look when they get on stage at Seaver. So the, the concert takes place at Seaver Theater, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday evening, April 26th, 27th, and 28th at 8 o'clock, and on Sunday, April the 29th, at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs>